hear more of very practical um, uh, ideas coming from Radoslav Koshko, who I mentioned is the country general manager uh, for Schneider Electric throughout the region. Okay, to the respect with the audience and the president of, of the Republic, I will also speak in Bulgarian. I would also like to uh, start by extending my gratitude uh, to the organizers for holding such um, a beautiful event uh, in this situation, uh, observing all uh, measures. On behalf, I will speak about sustainability on behalf of um, Schneider Electric and how we see it and um, some of our um, views. It is essential uh, that there are several transformations that we are facing, digital transformation and transformation towards sustainability. They are organically interrelated because we cannot achieve sustainability without uh, digitization. And it's also it's pointless uh, to invest in digitalization if we do not have a sustainability uh, plan. It is essential for the businesses to understand that one of the most important truths is that our business goals, uh, our business goals and our sustainability goals, goals uh, are interrelated too, because any uh, uh, penny saved uh, from energy, any resource that we can use, any um, manufacturing operation uh, made uh, more effective, more efficient, has a financial <coughs> dimension. <coughs> and um, a sustainable uh, company is not uh, a green um, uh, value which is vague and it's only used for advertising. It's a clear clear-cut business goal with its financial parameters and it is linked to uh, company development and with its reputation in the future. So this is what we should understand uh, when we talk about sustainability. Let me give you a few examples. Data exchange in real time. A reduction of our own um, carbon uh, footprint, uh, digital um, operations, uh, recycling energy efficiency with the um, empowerment of uh, local communities. And when companies and business organizations uh, understand the benefits of um, this mindset, they would initiate and they would uh, step up their own transformation and they will be proactive uh, in this, uh, uh, on this path towards sustainability. Now, a few words of what we do at Schneider Electric. We try to support these two transformations, sustainability through uh, digitalization, so that they could, we could make uh, these transformations more easily accessible for everyone with our own um, <coughs> role model. We start with our own units, with our um, warehouses, even with our car park, with our car fleet, uh, um, automobile fleet. We offer the market solutions, technologies, software, that are accessibly, accessible thanks to the expertise and services that we offer. Then we evolved to um, include our partners and our suppliers and in their sustainability plans, uh, we want to make sure that uh, they will be part of our overall plan that links this all in one as leaders, as one of the leaders in this uh, segment that uh, um, we create such sustainability um, examples, we are called upon to be the leader of this uh, change, of this shift, and we are open for uh, a dialogue with the institutions. And um, this is the, the point in time where I should, um, when I should talk about uh, the regulatory framework because it will blaze the trail for all our efforts. 
And let me um, end up by uh, saying the most important um, uh, statement behind all these technologies and processes, behind all these um, sustainability practices, there are people, us. It all starts from us. It all boils down to us because we are the ones to champion uh, the change. If we want to live in a more sustainable future, digital technologies are out there. They are out there to help us. But it is our decision how to walk the line towards our goals. Thank you.